We're going to the politics and eggs breakfast, which is a tradition if you're running for president. We're going to see Bill Weld, who is a former Republican governor of Massachusetts. See, I follow through. And he's the first legitimate challenger to Donald Trump in the primary. Is he a threat to the nomination? Unlikely. But he's very popular here, and he's a wily guy. I'm here because I think our country is in grave peril. And I cannot sit any longer quietly on the sidelines. I have established an exploratory committee to pursue the possibility of my running for the presidency of the United States as a Republican in the 2020 election. President is going to declare a national emergency is being reported. The Democrats are opposed, but now Republicans are opposed as well. Well, that's good. Uh, maybe, maybe it won't happen. I don't agree with the president's policy on immigration. I think he's just waving a bloody shirt all the time, and it's extremely unattractive. Do you think you're going to make the dam break with other Republicans following you across the bridge here now? I don't know. I mean, you know, if a cracks appear in the dam of the president's support, I think you may see a gold rush. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Bye. What does it say that you're the first and so far only Republican to challenge the president uh, for, the, for the nomination? The president has kind of cowed substantial elements of the Republican Party. And I do want to shake up the party. He obviously ran a pretty good campaign. It's the two years since then that have me concerned, his performance in office. Some would say that his calling for a national emergency is something in that category. <clears throat> He seems to think he can do anything at will, and that's not really true for a president of the United States.